Here with Evan Royster. Evan, huge game tonight, 140 plus rushing yards, and now you're the career leader in, in rushing at Penn State. Talk about that. Um, you know, it feels good. It's been talked about all season. I feel like I just got the monkey off my back. You know, get on with the season and, and talk about it later. What was working tonight? You really set the tone early with the big first quarter, and then from there things just kind of snowballed. Um, you know, we, we got a lot of movement up front. You know, we, we, got, we had our linebackers guessing at, at where we were running the ball. And, uh, it was an all around good game plan. How good does it feel when you find holes like that and you're able to put, you know, get chalk some yardage up and put some points on the board? Uh, it's a big confidence goal, you know. Um, I think it's good for all our offenses as a whole. You know, um, just, just setting the tone with the run game is really important how critical was it to, to keep you on the field, the offense on the field, to keep Denard, Denard off the field? Um, it was huge. Ball, ball possession was, was huge for us. You know, they started to come back a little bit in the second half, and that was because we weren't, we weren't possessing the ball like, like we needed to. But we were able to kind of stick it out long enough to the end. Talk about the job Matt did tonight. First career start, 41 points, big win at home. Talk about that. I mean, he, he's got a ton of potential. You know, he, he's, he played great today, and uh, you know, he, he's making all kinds of plays. The big thing is we were converting on third downs, you know, and that, that, that really kept their offense off the field most of the game, and, and it really helped us out. Talk about the offensive line. Big day for them, too. Oh, yeah. It was huge. Um, like I said, they were, moving, they were pushing people around in the first half, just moving, on, moving all over the place, and yeah, that's, that's huge for the run game. Uh, you know, the, the protection was good all game, too. Uh, again, that's what's up. How about the crowd tonight? Oh, it was unbelievable. You know, they were they were all into it. And, uh, I don't think I saw a single person stand up to me to, to go get a snack or anything. You know, they were all there supporting us all, all the way. Big win tonight on to Northwestern next week. How much confidence does the team have now? Um, a ton. You know, I, think we'll, I think we'll carry this over into next week and have a good game. Congratulations on the honor and best of luck next week. Thank you. Here with Matt McGloin. Matt, first career start. You step off the bus first. Huge win tonight. Talk about your game and how it felt out there. It's a great feeling tonight. Uh, you know, we played great. The, the, obviously, it's a great atmosphere for college football. Eight o'clock game on ESPN. We had a great week of practice. It really showed tonight. How, how did you feel comfort-wise out there? Right, it looked like right away you were locked in with the receivers and you're ready to go. Yeah, you know, I was waiting for the butterflies to kick in, but they never got there. You know, I, I felt confident. I felt we had a great week of practice. You know, I took it. I took my time going over my stuff. Didn't cram the last second. I knew what was going to happen defensively. And we executed. I had great players around me tonight. I'm fortunate for that. Talk about the execution. The offense at one point, you know, scored had six scoring drives out of seven. You know, you guys were really scoring at will. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that, that's what we had to do against, especially against a team like Michigan, who's going to put up big numbers. I, I stressed it all week. I said we have to control the ball. We have to keep Denard Robinson off the field, and, and we did that for most of the night. Talk about the offensive line. What can I say? I think I was only knocked down maybe twice tonight. You know, they had a great, great, great practice. Great practice this week. You know, they had a lot of confidence in me, and I had a lot of confidence in them as well in the show. What did you see? What did you see on the touchdown pass to Zug? Oh, uh, you know, they, was, actually that was a play we knew we got last year at Michigan with Daryl. We knew we were going to have it again this year. Uh, they dropped down into uh, man coverage, and I knew Graham was going to beat the guy. Talk about now with this went under your belt. How much confidence does it give the offense heading into the rest of the year? It definitely gives. You know, we're right back in the race. Right back in the race now. We're going five and three right now, and we just got to we just got to continue to practice hard. I mean, we have Northwestern coming up this week. That's a great football team. It's going to be another tough game. Great game tonight. Thank you. Here with Quinn Barm. Quinn, huge night for the offense tonight. What was working up front? Man, I think we just, we had something we call gas today. And it's something we're trying to get in the last two weeks. Just gas, we just turned it up. And uh, I think one thing started clicking. I think the coaches made the right decisions, the right calls. Uh, the backs I got in the right holes. And then we obviously see those holes for Evan got eclipsed the career mark. How much uh, How much does that make you, happy does that guy make you? Oh, that feels great. That feels great. That's one of our goals, I think, at least uh, for the season. And I think we knew we were at least going to get it. And I'm happy for it. I'm happy for it. Huge night all around for the offense tonight. How much confidence does that give you guys moving forward to put 41 points up against a good team? It feels so good, man. If you're going to go out tonight, have a good time, but it feels so good just to get things rolling again. And Michigan was a great team. Lar, he did his thing. Even the defense was great as well. And I think they just clicked for us tonight. And uh, we didn't want to let the fans down. Last time at homecoming, that's something you don't want to remember. But uh, I think this game would definitely be about some of the fans. You mentioned the fans. How about the crowd tonight? Oh, they were great tonight. They were great. I mean, the spirit was there. The, the, the noise was there. And we love the crowd. Thank you. Thank you. Great game tonight.
Mike. Here with Mike Motti. Mike, talk about tonight's game. Great all-around performance. Yeah, great all-around, man. We got we both stepped up big time. We started, you know, started good slinging that ball around. <laughs> And no, we score points, that helps us out, I man. We're getting our defense is fresh the whole game. So I mean we came in there every, every series, we're ready to roll and you know, and then you know, we let a few slide in the third, fourth quarter, and then once we really need to stop, then that's when we stepped it up and then guys made some plays. So how much confidence does this give you guys now heading into next week's game? Oh, uh, it's a big game. I mean it's a big confidence booster for us and I mean I think that you know, we just like I said, we each week we're trying to get better and it's, it's the next step. We got four more left and so it's the next Talk step. about playing Denard Robinson. How difficult was he to bring down? I mean, he's a tough guy. He's, I mean, he definitely lived up to the hype. He was, you know, I mean, a shifty guy to get a hold of, and you know, and then he's got the 4-2 speed to match that. So, I mean, he's, you know, he's a credit to him. He's a good, he's a good player. So. How about the crowd tonight? <laughs> Unbelievable, man. You, you live for the play on the under the lights like that, especially in Beaver Stadium, 110,000 people. It's, it's, uh, I mean, you can't get anything better than that. Great game tonight. Here with Drew Astorino. Drew, talk about tonight's game. Great all-around performance from you guys. Uh, yeah, you know, the offense really picked it up today. Defense didn't play great. We're going to have to, uh, you know, fix some things, but credit to offense, Matt McGloin and Evan Royster, and they just crushed it tonight, so it was big for us. How difficult was Denard to stop? Uh, I mean, he's hard to stop. Not only that, but they run a tough offense, and he's a great player. So, yeah, he, uh, he did about it whatever he wanted to do today. Talk about the crowd. How, how big a role did they play tonight? Oh, I mean, absolutely huge. You know, Michigan got some big, crucial penalties. They were, I mean, loud, into it all game from the beginning of the game. And, you know, that's like a 12th guy out there on defense. I think half the time they couldn't call the place uh, snaps, and they were getting frustrated. So it was, they were, I mean, unbelievable tonight. Great game tonight. Another one next week. Talk about the confidence level now. Uh, I mean, the confidence level, it was great to have a win, but you got to forget about it. We're going to go to focus next week.